In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to set up your email address once you've purchased Bluehost web hosting. And the purpose of setting up an email address is because when you have a website, you can have a custom email where you can have your name at your website domain URL. So for example, my website golfpracticeguides.com, I can have my first name Nick at golfpracticeguides.com or Nick at asknickfoy.com. So that way it seems like you have a professional email address by having your own personal website domain uh, after the at sign. So now how do you set up an email in Bluehost? Well, first you're going to want to log into your Bluehost account. So go to bluehost.com, click log in, enter your username and password, hit the submit button, and it brings you to your home page, which is the screen you're seeing right now. So you're going to want to scroll down and there's this email section here. So you're going to go ahead and click that and it's going to be email manager. And then it's going to open up to a new page where you can click create email account. You're going to enter your uh, the name that you want here to go before the at sign. And then you can pick your website from the drop down. If you have multiple websites, then you're going to be able to select which one you're trying to create the email for. So in my case, it shows my under 30 wealth.com website here. If, but I can go ahead and hit the drop down and select any of my other websites. So you type in, you know, an email address there. So we'll say support at under 30 wealth.com. And then you're going to want to go ahead and put in a password and retype your password. And it's got a bunch of different rules here to follow about how to make a strong enough password and it won't let you continue until you've met all these rules. You can choose a default webmail client. So you can pick Horde, Roundcube, or Squirrel Mail. I personally always use Squirrel Mail, but you can look at all three of them and see which one, the layout and the design and the functionality, which one you like best. And then you're just going to go ahead and hit Create and it's going to set you up and that's it. You're done. You've got your email account and now you have your username and your password. So you can go ahead and log in anytime to your Bluehost email account. And if you're tech savvy, you can come in here and it'll, you can find the, um, you can scroll down here and it'll show you basically a list of all your email addresses, but you're going to want to go to view details. If you ever want to add it to your iPhone, You'll click view details and it'll give you your server information so that when you go into your iPhone and you add a new email into your iPhone, you could put in the server information so your iPhone knows how to pull the emails from your web host email inbox. And that's how you can send and receive in emails from your iPhone. So that's something you're going to need to play around with once you create your email. And otherwise, that wraps up this tutorial. It's just a quick walkthrough of how to log into Bluehost. Go to the email section and go to email manager and then click create new email and it brings you to this page here where you can set up your email and click create. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos on how to build a successful profitable online business. You can also stop by asknickfoy.com where I have weekly blog posts and podcasts showing you additional steps to grow and get traffic to your website. Take care.